<laughs> I, I still don't know how to play pickleball, Lisa. You can give me I a will lesson. teach you. I will teach okay. you next week. All right. Yeah. And eventually I'm teaching Mark. It's going to happen. He's also the chief pickleball meteorologist. Oh, because that. wind is very important in pickleball. Is that? I, I didn't see a wind sock at that court. No. Mm. No. <laughs> but I can tell you there was no wind out there today. <laughs> okay, fine. Um, I learned that the wind's important in pickleball. Yeah. Learned that from Lisa. <laughs> this is the way it looks from Live Copter 3. Um, as you can see down below, that is Interstate 80. We've been documenting the slow traffic on Interstate 80. So we're not too far from Davis looking towards Sacramento. And yeah, just another really nice day for this time of year. It is warm. But not too warm for this time of year. Right now in Sacramento at Executive Airport, the temperature stands at 89. There's the key wind southwesterly at 11. So just like the last couple of evenings, it will be warm in the evening. By 8 o'clock, the sun goes down just a little bit after 8 o'clock tonight, 76 degrees. And by midnight, temperatures will be in the 60s. However, as we go through the night, we're going to start to catch a few clouds coming our way. Right now we have mainly clear skies, but look down in Stanislaus County. Look at the clouds coming up from the south. There's more cloud cover into Mono County and those clouds are on the way to the north. We don't have anything in the way of rain just yet, but down on 395 there may be some light showers. If you go farther to the south down toward Bakersfield, look at this rain. There's some good rain going on here over the grapevine and then look at how this is moving. It's coming up from the south. We're going to have to keep an eye on this. There's a chance that in southern Monterey County tonight, we could even see a couple of lightning strikes and that'll be our concern going forward over the next couple of days. So during the night tonight, we will have those clouds come our way during the night and then tomorrow is what we'll watch for the Sierra. This is tomorrow afternoon around the middle part of the day. Thunderstorms developing on the crest of the Sierra moving north, probably impacting areas including the Tahoe Basin during the afternoon. And then as we head into Friday night, those clouds once again come down the hill. And this will be a pattern we'll see over the next few days. Thunderstorms develop in the Sierra. The clouds come down the hill, but they, that leaves the foothills and the valley dry. But we will include the chance of thunderstorms. Don't think we'll see that in Quincy or Pollock Pines and Arnold, but Tahoe and Truckee tomorrow do have the chance of thunderstorms. Some of the clouds will make, it, make their way down the hill. Temperatures will be in the mid to upper 80s in the foothills with Angels Camp seeing a high of 88. Along the coast, not much in the way of marine layer. Otherwise, just a partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, Fairfield, a warm day with a high of 86. And for the valley, look for increasing clouds tonight. Partly cloudy skies tomorrow with highs in the upper 80s to low 90s. And tonight, with increasing clouds, overnight lows will drop down to the low 60s. Highs tomorrow, upper 80s to around 90 with a mixture of sun and clouds. Temperatures will be warming slightly through the weekend. By Monday, we could be over 100. And the early part of next week does look as though to be over 100. But by the end of the week, it likely cools off once again.